you know, you ever look at these posters to think, that's definitely a kid. A kid. Anyway, hey guys, you Kirby here with another episode of Borderlands Zombie Island of Dr. Ned. Ned, love, uh, yeah. In the last episode, we had gone through All Hallows Eve, take it down to down pumpkin head, the monster's pumpkin head, found TK Baja alive, not doing anything with him, and we also met Dr. Ned, who directed us to head over to the hospital, well, to his old hospital, where he has a, um, has an antidote waiting for us. We also have another side quest for there. Unfortunately, this one's gonna be tied to another quest. So yeah, we actually need to head to General Only Hospital twice. Sorry for spoilers, but this kind of ties into why I don't like the, why, to one of the reasons why I'm not a fan of the second DLC. Yeah, luckily, unlike that, it's the only time we have to do this. Screw you guys. Stop that. Yeah, so spooky. Move this. And enter generally hospital. <laughs> yeah, my nose is still plugged up, I'm sorry. All right, so our, so our main, so luckily, as you see, it's a big area. Luckily for our quests, we're just sticking with the, with this little hilly area. So we're not exploring the other stuff yet. Anything I want, I will gladly take that. Cause that's actually good. That's a new shield, stronger shield for me. Thank you game. I don't care that I had that I, that it goes from that I would just got one boost. Honestly, it was a, it was boost for both of them, so I'm happy. First verse, same to reverse. Just run, and ignore zombies. Like seriously, just ignore them. This sucks. Okay, we're not. Not gonna lie, this, this sucks. This run and avoid the zombies. Like. Okay, just fuck off. And here we are. Interesting. Well, since the other one's down over that way, and since we're already up here, let's head too. Just head over to this way, because the door is locked. Okay, looks familiar. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our first boss, the Wear Skag Hank Rice. So sadly, we know what happened to him. And yes, Wear Skags. Because, duh. Basically, he fights just like a, like a Feral Skag date. Kill him if they run in. I'm actually kind of mad that I didn't swap quickly. Because you actually can kill them super fast. Before they actually they actually power themselves up, but basically, they're not special. They're just it. It's kind of sad. Like, eh, would you, would you drop though? Don't want that. Don't want. I don't need that. Please be please be more useful than than we got. Hey, rocket launcher. 
I'll take it. Oh, triple launcher. Oh, okay, cool. It's a rapid fire one. Okay, cool. I was actually worried that it was a helix one. And, oh, hey, those suck. Anyway, why do you throw the trash? Well, there's the antidote. And there's the story quest. Huh. Nice job, Persos. Anyway. Jump. Go down this way. For the second quest. Don't worry, we'll be exploring the beach after the side quest. Because that's what we, where we need to be going for it. Because joy. That was my phone. I hear it's as chill as a cheesecake's teeth in a winter's morn. But it does not dampen my resolve. I found strength in prayer. And with little whiskey I have remaining in my flask. Monster of the hospital. His arms proved to be harder to kick than the rest of this rabble. He kicked me in the neck. Well, that did not feel strange. Hopefully I'll have the right. At least it is a full moon to keep me company. Ah, oh boy. Ah. <sighs> I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. But that's both of those done. But don't worry. We'll be back. Oh, we'll be back. Yeah, it's basically... Basically, we're actually almost done with this now, you know? Like, we have like, what, three quests left? Three, four quests left, yeah. The DLCs, doing the story are, isn't really short, except for the second one. The second one's kind of the longest of all of them. Anyway, let's get, let's keep going. I I don't like the fact that the filer slow you down to a fucking crawl. That's gross. Anyway, made it back. Let's give claptrap the stuff. Claptrap, this is a game. I'm sorry, no one's laughing. Oh, thank goodness! Get me the hell out of here! We have precious little time! Before you go up and help that lying mobile toaster, you'll want to hear this. Dr. Nate is not who you think he is. And he's about as trustworthy as my dog I put down for being untrustworthy. Whoa! <laughs> whoa! Ooh, where'd that come from? Gotcha! Who bought? Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa! Just kidding around here! Kidding around! Don't, don't forget, to forget everything I just... This is all true, but don't take my word for it. Look for yourself. Take the rope tied to the pier to the lab on the other side. You'll find a door in the sound that will require a special knock. I love special knocks. Wow! I'm the dad. The knock sounds like this. Now go and leave this robot for the skag. I will literally murder the person of your choosing if you just let me out of here. I never even liked Marcus. Just just say the word. Why did you point at Marcus, Claptrap? That's weird. Anyway. In hindsight, it was probably just a better judgment than makes his tent. But his passion outside the box thing convinced us. Unfortunately, he was not the last person to in our situation. Here we go again. Find out. Oh. 
But I want to have it to the others who came to stop the zombies. To whoever discovers the circumstances of Jackie O'Callaghan's death, HR has informed me that there are four others like yourself who are hired to deal with the issue. These employees have also seen run into some difficulties. Try to turn one half to them. Okay, we cannot do this one. Well, we're more like we're not going to. It takes us to the lumberyard. Spoiler, that is our last location of the, of the DLC. So we're going to be doing that when, when it's time to actually go finish this. Also, I forgot about that that one appears right then and not the other one. Claptrap was hacked. Let's see the story about Dr. Ned. Secrets and Mysteries. Find Ned's original lab, see if who he is, who he says he is. Someone hacked in a cloud trap, left a few cryptic messages. So, you were told that Dr. Ned is not to be trusted. You can find find Ned's old laboratory by taking the boat off the island. Find Ned's lab and use your knock tinter. Ah, there it is. Find and kill the pack. Find and kill the members of the pack. Dr. Ned here. Seems like my antidote from Skag Blood didn't really have quite the 10 results. You're lucky, you can't, you're lucky, sorry, you can't, so called weird Skag. At least I'd say he was the only one, but their test said they seem to have foreign pat terrorized the coastline by the old hospital. But you should really take care of what's spread that disease as well. Man, I sometimes I wonder if I should have been in the villains an NPC. Yep, yep, kill Whiskey Weasley, Bigfoot, Red Jack, and Father O'Callahan. And it's alive. Uncover what happened to Frankie Gorski and deliver his severance. To any of the Jacobs <laughs> Jacob to the any employee of Jacobs Corporation. We we at Hypertips in the division of Hyperion Industri Industrial Offered an invitation to whoever can determine the whereabouts of its contractor we sent to work with the Jacobs coming physician. Frankie Gorski is not reported to his agent for over a month. As direct result from this behavior, Frank has been terminated. We now have a severance package that needs to be delivered to. Please find the information on this new situation and deliver the package. Sorry, Claptrap, we're going to ignore you. Alright. So, back to General Lee Hospital to deal with the pack. This is the quest I was talking about. <sighs> and unfortunately, like I said, it's in an area we haven't really been to. Otherwise, I would honestly have just kind of skipped straight to where it is. But, yeah. Oh. Didn't realize that counts. Oh, hey! That was lucky. I thought I basically activated the one in, one in Jacob's Cove. That's lucky. That is 100% lucky. Anyway, path, the first path, part of the path is still the same. Basically, just head up the hospital. Just up, head up to the hospital. Screw you. Just screw you. And like I said, you easily can. Explosives also work against zombies. So don't worry about, oh, I'm gonna waste rocket launcher. No, either use bullets or, ro or explosives. All right, now that we are back over here, instead, we want to go to the left. Let's get, yeah, sorry about that. Enter through this cove to find a, li a little um, elevator. But you also do not really need to take the elevator. You guys, you can just drop down. Luckily, there are no zombies on the coast. 
It's just you, the the corpse eaters, and the and these guys. Starting with with the priest himself, Father O'Callahan. These guys basically. Ah, I hate that. I just, I really hate that. These guys basically fight the same as Hank. So it's like, why even do this quest? This quest is stupid. There. Barlow and O'Callahan gone. Come on. I think I'm just unlucky in that, okay? Unfortunately, there's no waypoints for each of them, but fortunately, the path is actually really quite simple to go through. No, nope, not this one. <laughs> eh, sorry about that. Yeah, more corpse ears because goddamn. Oh, there's Whiskey Wesley. There, dead. See? You can easily kill them. Come on, game. God, screw you both. Anyway, we lost leveled up, so next up on our list is striking, which adds days to our um to our melee attacks. So I'll probably use them more. Who knows? <laughs> uh, what did he, yeah, there it is. <sighs> oh, Delorex. I don't know why they do this. I do not know why they make, they have two different skag reskins. It's real. It's really weird. Okay, it's just it is. Go over to this way to find the next one, Redjack. God fucking a. You damn rats go away. Dead. Me? Fuck you off. Like seriously, fuck off, game. Over here to find Bigfoot. Who knows why he's called Bigfoot? There, all of them are dead. There, that is that quest. <laughs> Usually you'll find this guy, Luku. Basically he is a badass taken sign with a um, chest instead of Instead of a bomb. We have for us shotgun. Nope. And an S and fire and some G. No. There we go. Alright. Nah, we'll take the walk nah, we'll take the walk back. I kinda of, I just wanna feel like that thing more. Like, that, that was it. Those are the swear skags, by the way. We have no other enemy types after this. It's all zombies. Zombies, zombies, zombies. Don't get me wrong. I like games like Resident Evil. I, I think 4 is honestly my favorite of, this, of that series. Granted, I've also never beaten any of the games of that series. But, yeah. Honestly, I feel that they don't do this well, in my honest opinion. 
they do it really annoyingly. And it's like, eh. But yeah, so basically, this is this one's not really that fun. I mean, I, I like this story. I like this story. But honestly, the, the writing doesn't get better until the next DLC. But even then, I also don't... I also don't like it because of a because of more backtracking than it will do and trust me backtracking is will be a thing in that one I also do wish that basically the sirens um phase walk just basically removes the goo Back clap trap, are you done being weirdo? You guys can see this, right? He does not have the ropes on him and he is still acting like he's tied up. That is funny. Thanks for that. At least now the lair skags won't kill the zombies and become a bigger problem. Yeah, that's what I meant. And that's where we're going to go ahead and end this episode. Claptrap, shut up. You're tied up. I don't want to get into whatever weird... Whatever weird fetishes you guys have. Anyway, this is where we're going to go and end the episode. Next time, we're going to head to... We're going to head to... Uh, head to Ned's lab and see exactly what the hacker means thanks for watching guys i will see you all next time take care everyone